it's not financial advice, it's not legal advice for entertainment educational purposes only and everything I say is my opinion. Please don't make any financial decision based on anything I say in these videos. That being said, hit the like button, subscribe button, all the YouTube algorithm stuff. So you can video, I'll put them out, see them things, see them analyze that data. Like I tell every day, the data they released us is false. And when I say they released us, I, 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 I'm getting a lot of hate for this one. But the data, the data Adam Aaron released us is not always correct also. Okay, because some of his tweets, some of the statements he makes are out, outright fabrications. Outright fabrications. Here's the thing. Adam Aaron is pushing the reverse split. And he, you, you have a lot of, of YouTubers who thinks it's a great idea. Nothing in my mind, no matter how I, I look at it, and I've tried to look at it in, in the most conservative way possible, and I can't see... I can't see how anybody could think it's a good idea to give up 90% of your shares. And the thing is, the narrative that, that, that I've had and that a lot of other retail investors have had over the last two years is to buy as much as possible and hold on to them because the more shares you have, the more shares, the bad actors, the hedgies, the people who've been selling us billions of kind of shares are going to have to buy back in order to close their positions. So to wipe out 90% of those shares overnight makes absolutely no sense. It's counterproductive. It is totally contrary to what our goal has been for the last two years. And correct me if I'm wrong, Adam Aaron made this announcement, and like I told you in the previous video, when he sold Antara all those ape shares for less than what it was selling for in the open market, that contract also required him to have a meeting in 90 days from that date. So we're talking like by March 22nd, we're supposed to have the emergency meeting, I guess, to take the vote. But here's the thing. Why doesn't Adam Aaron put out a video or a statement that's telling us all the great benefits of the reverse split. I mean, I haven't seen a video from him explaining it to me. And, and the bottom line is this. And, 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 and I'm not telling you to buy, hold, or sell. I'm not telling you to vote no. I'm not telling you to vote yes. But, but what, what I'm telling you is this. Basic mathematics tells me that losing 90% volume of what I have is not good. And these arguments that they're making about the QCIP number, the QCIP number, I mean, that also requires the bad actors, the hedgies, who've been breaking the law for the last two years, probably longer than that, but the last two years that we've been paying attention. Why do you think that all of a sudden, after we give them a 90% haircut, we, we, we give them a, 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 a golden ticket, we give them a golden ticket, 90% of their shares just disappear. They're going to decide, oh, now we're going to start following the law. Now we're going to start looking for real shares. We're going to find real locates. You think they're going to find real locates now that we wiped out 90% of their counterfeit shares? No. They're going to get, they're just going to re-up and bring it back up again. That's all they're going to do. They're not going to find no real locates anymore. We know there are no locates. So all they're going to do is, is start fabricating the counterfeit shares Again and again and again. The only way to stop them, and this is just my opinion, the only way to stop them is for us to make sure that they have to cover those billions, those billions of counterfeit shares that they forced into the market because of their greed. Anyway, please leave some comments and tell me what you think. What is Adam Aaron? gonna 
put out a video explaining the benefits of this reverse split that he has everybody talking about. Anyway, have a great day. God bless. And I appreciate y'all on this journey with me.